My name is Damien Connolly, I'm a Senior Analytical Scientist here at APC and we're located in South County Dublin. APC's mission is to accelerate the delivery of life-changing medicines to patients and we do that by partnering with eight of the top ten global pharmaceutical companies and five of the top ten biopharmaceutical companies. We deliver on projects across uh, all phases of product development from phase one through to marketed products uh, and across a wide range of uh, therapeutic areas. Within the Technical Operations Group, our work is divided between two main pillars of research, small molecules work and, and large molecules or, or bioprocess optimization. We have over 100 uh, researchers and technical support staff here at APC. Um, over 80% of them have PhDs and there's roughly a 33% split between chemical engineers, bioprocess engineers uh, and then research scientists and finally analysts. We have excellent facilities here at APC. Um, we have over 60,000 square foot of laboratory space that's divided between chemical engineering space for crystallization, optimization and uh, formulation studies. We have uh, mammalian um, cell culture laboratories, microbial fermentation laboratories. Uh, we work on projects involving um, gene vector uh, products, uh, so gene therapy and, and cell therapy product products. And so it's, it's really a very dynamic working environment here at APC. The daily tasks within the analytical laboratories uh, involve running analytical methods, so uh, GC methods, particularly residual solvents, uh, and HPLC methods for uh, um, characterising impurity profiles. Most of the methods that arrive in to APC are already validated uh, by our clients. Uh, that said, we do sometimes engage in method optimization or indeed full method development activities and associated method validation activities as, as needs arise. We decided to buy Agilent OpenLab software at a time which coincided with the expansion of our analytical capabilities here at APC. There were a few business drivers which led to the adoption of Agilent OpenLab CDS at APC. Firstly, cost. Obviously, running a, a networked system is a lot more cost effective, particularly when it comes to adding new Agilent equipment to our suite of instrumentation in our laboratories. There are very obvious productivity gains um, that we've experienced right from the get-go when we brought Agilent Open Lab CDS on board. Analysts don't need to spend so much time in the laboratory, they can perform all of their, their data analysis uh, in the office space uh, right at their desk. It also streamlines our training initiatives when we bring new staff on board. Moving to Agilent was um, really a no-brainer given the, the excellent support that we get from the, the local Agilent team. The day-to-day -day use of OpenLab, we've seen real benefits for the analysts. There are custom calculation routines within OpenLab, which means no more use of Excel, no more transcription errors. The report generation for, for customers is very easy, very intuitive. Um, we can design custom reports for particular clients and from a compliance and regulatory perspective, system administrators here at APC can very easily restrict access or grant access to particular analysts or researchers. The benefits from an IT perspective are pretty obvious. Automated uh, backup of, of, of data, we're able to also monitor the capacity of, of equipment. So how often are we using HPLCs and GCs? How often are systems down? We can also monitor uh, man hour capacity because with access control, we know exactly how many analysts are interacting with HPLCs and GCs in any one working week, for example. The support that Agilent have given us right from the inception of APC as a, as a company has been really fantastic, uh, both on the hardware side and also the, the software side of things. I would definitely recommend OpenLab CDS to my colleagues. 
It offers seamless integration of new equipment into um, an ever-expanding laboratory. Uh, the fact that you can perform data analysis and reporting remotely significantly reduces the, uh, the number of people in our laboratories. So even from a safety perspective, there are, are benefits accruing there. The fact that we don't have individual workstations for every piece of equipment significantly decreases the, the footprint of those workstations uh, within our laboratories. And obviously our IT department spend a lot less time in the laboratory uh, so that we can spend um, more time doing excellent research.